So I know that you broke your hand a couple weeks ago and you got released by your doctor. Um, so it's weight bearing is tolerated. You're free to do whatever. Mm -hmm. um, but based on that, how are you feeling so far with your progress? I'm good. Good? Okay. I'm missing. So I know you're a teacher and you do a lot of writing on the whiteboard. Um, do you have any pain or do you feel like you're kind of lagging in that? Um, only sometimes, like when I'm writing too much. But I don't know. I think I'm good. Okay, cool. Well, that's why we're here, so we can um, perfect those skills, okay? Okay. Um, so today, I kind of want to I want to do another test since we're going to do kind of like a reeval situation with you. Um, so I explained this test to you in the past. So it's called the nine-hole peg test, and the grip strength on this actually will give us a, a good read on to what it's going to look like for you to continue writing on the whiteboard and how long it'll take you to get back to where you need to be. Um, does that sound good to you? Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, so I'm going to read you the instructions. And let me know if you have any questions or if it doesn't make sense, okay? So what we're going to do is we're going to pick up the pegs one at a time. And you're right hand dominant, correct? Yes. Okay. So you're going to use your right hand and you're going to put each peg into each hole until they're all filled. Once they're all filled, you're going to remove them one by one. The goal is to do this as fast as you can. Does that make sense? Yes. Okay. So I'm going demo to demo it to you first. And then after I demo it to you, we're going to do a trial um, with your right hand before we actually start the test, okay? okay? too hard or no, 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 okay <laughs> sounds good and then whenever you're finished um I'm just gonna jot down your scores and I'm gonna tally them up real fast for you and I'll let you know kind of where you fall in the category of your age range or I hope okay. okay so you're gonna stabilize with the hand that you're not using okay that way we can keep it in place all right, um, so on the trial, you're gonna do that exactly how I explained to you with the instructions. And then after that, um, we'll pause and take a break if you need and start the actual test. Okay. All right, whenever you're ready. So the instructions are the same with the actual test, um, but we just want you to work as fast as possible, so that's going to be the only difference. Um, let me know if you need to stop, take a break, or if it starts to hurt, that's totally fine. Okay. All right, so you're going to start with your right hand again, all right, and then you're going to stabilize with the hand you're not using. Okay. And whenever you're ready. So now we're going to go with the left hand, and don't be surprised if this is a little slower just because it's not your dominant hand, okay? okay. So whenever you're ready. Okay. 
Okay. So um, you fall within the norms. Your second hand was just a little bit slow, um, but we'll work on that moving forward. But your right hand looks great. Um, there's always room for improvement, but you're right where you need to be so far in your progression, okay? All right, thank you. Thank you.